guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to my first concealer review I don't know why I haven't done one before considering I have tried a million and one concealers by now but anywho here we are today with the L'Oreal true match eye cream concealer so let's start off with me applying the concealer uh, make sure you shake it well because otherwise the oils in the concealer do separate and it doesn't get absorbed it just sits on your skin like little droplets the concealer does come in 14 shades and I got C1-2 called fair this is what the shade looks like on the back of my hand um, in terms of texture it's more on the thinner side possibly because it is part eye cream so it's more like a serum texture so I'm going to start off with applying the concealer on one side of my face without any foundation just so I can see how it sits on just my natural skin so this is after just uh, one layer of the concealer and then no concealer on this side and as you can see that this side is more brighter than this um, I don't think that my under eye circles are that dark so it does take care of it and it does brighten my under eye area now I'm going to um, take my favorite foundation and apply it on the other side of my face and then put the concealer on top and see how that works And now I'm just going to go in with the concealer just a little bit. I'm just going to apply another layer of concealer on both sides just to see um, how it builds up. So this is what my face is looking like after two layers of the concealer. Um, there is definitely some creasing under my eyes. It's nothing that a setting powder won't fix. And then in terms of the acne scar, it seems to have covered it well. And in terms of texture, it doesn't feel like I have any concealer on. In fact, when I touch under my eyes, it doesn't feel dry. It feels hydrating without being tacky, if that makes any sense. Anyways, I'll finish up the rest of my makeup and I'll be right back. For the claims, it says that it provides instant dark circle correction with 24 hours of hydration. I'm assuming that the hydration is from the 0.5% hyaluronic acid that's in the concealer. It is suitable for all skin types including sensitive skin and it is dermatologist and ophthalmologist tested for safety. Now they say that the formula is paraben free, non comedogenic which just means that it won't clog your pores and it is scent free but when I smell it there is a slight scent to it it's not a very strong one but definitely a light scent to the concealer and on the box it says that the eye area looks fresher and less puffy in just one week of use however on the website it says that it takes four weeks to notice any results so let me know in the comments down below if you have used this uh, concealer and how long did it take you to notice any results. The box says that it is a lightweight blendable formula. So I'm assuming that they meant that it is a light coverage concealer because it is definitely more light coverage as compared to my other concealers. And as you guys saw, I did put on two layers of the concealer to get a more full coverage look. Now in terms of the wear test, as I mentioned earlier, the concealer did uh, crease ever so slightly before I set it with my setting powder, but it has been two hours since I applied the concealer and set it and I don't notice any creasing under my eyes. So now I'll check back at the end of the day. It has been 10 hours since I applied the concealer and set it and it's still perfect. I don't notice any creasing or any caking under my eyes. 
comparing the two sides where on the right I put the concealer under the foundation and the left where I put the concealer on top of the foundation I don't notice any difference so whether you put your concealer before or after your foundation it really doesn't matter either way is fine So as always, let's start with the price. The original price in Canadian dollars is $15.99 plus tax and I got it for $12.99 plus tax because it was on sale at Shoppers and I feel like it is reasonably priced because most of the drugstore concealers that I have used are in the $10 to $15 price range. Now in terms of reviewing the actual product, I love the tube packaging because I can use it to directly apply the product under my eye just like a doe foot applicator but just remember you have to shake it well before using otherwise it will separate and since it has a thin consistency a little bit of the product will go a long way it is definitely a lightweight concealer that just melts into the skin brightening your under eye in just one layer if your under eye area is dry like mine especially after last week's video where I did five looks in one day so washing your face that much can definitely dry out your skin then you'll absolutely love it because it is a very hydrating concealer without feeling tacky however it is a light coverage concealer so if you have really dark under eye circles then I wouldn't recommend this concealer to you but if you want just a quick little pick me up because you didn't get enough sleep or you're just feeling tired then this concealer is great for you granted you don't mind it being light coverage and so for all these reasons I'm giving this L'Oreal true match eye cream concealer five stars and that brings us to the end of our video today if you liked it please take a moment to smash the like button if you've tried the concealer let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more beauty related videos and hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I upload my next video till then bye bye